Hey guys, welcome back to Mixing It Up with Michelle. Today, you build your own home gym on a budget. We're all about health and fitness here. Gym memberships can get expensive. Sometimes, we just want to work out in the comfort of our own home. We decided to take the plunge, order one of the most essential pieces of gym equipment around, and that's a Smith machine. I found an affordable one on Amazon. I'm going to unbox it, show you the process of putting it together, give you some tips on how to build your own affordable home gym without breaking the bank. So, let's get started. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's your favorite YouTuber, Michelle, here at Mixing It Up with Michelle. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. So this is the Smith machine I ordered. It's one of the more budget-friendly options on Amazon, but don't let the price fool you. It has all the basics that you need to get a great workout. This video here shows you the machine that I purchased and some of the capabilities that it has. I'm excited to try some of these. Now I can do it in my garage and I don't have to spend the amount of money it costs at the gym. It's listed here at $5.99, but if you look, it has a coupon for $130 off, which makes this under $500. I'll make sure I go ahead and link this in the description box if anyone is interested. Here's the box it came in. It actually came in two separate boxes, and they didn't weigh all that much. Okay, let's open this up and see what's inside. I always recommend checking that all the parts are there before you start assembling anything. Oh, this is exciting. Now that everything's out of the box, you can see it's a bit of a puzzle, but nothing that we can't handle. Make sure you have your tools ready for this one. You'll probably need a wrench and a Phillips screwdriver. Oh, and pro tip, having an extra set of hands can really help when it comes to some of the bigger parts, but he's flying solo today, so let's do it. I know I'm working up quite the sweat just watching him. So now we have the base in place. Make sure everything is tight and sturdy before moving on to the next step. Next up, we've got the pulley system. That is what's actually going to make our attachments work, such as the landmine, attachment and the pull down bars okay guys here it is we've got the smith machine fully assembled and honestly it wasn't that hard the machine is perfect for squats bench presses shoulder presses you name it and what i love most is that it's super sturdy without taking up too much space So here we have our lat pull down bar. We have a landmine attachment. And basically, a landmine is where you put a barbell in there and you can do add weights to it, do different exercises. We have that attachment. We have foot pedals and a row bar so we can do rows, which is super cool. That's where our weight system goes in the back. Over here, we have spots where you can hold extra weight. I do have some coming in the mail. 
I just ordered them, so I'll have an extra 100 pounds worth of weights. Okay, this is the setup I have in my garage. I have my power tower I got for free, a weight bench, got off Amazon, about 50 bucks. This is the Smith machine, under 500, great, great quality, affordable. You can't beat it. Dumbbell set, Amazon, Pilates reformer, power machine, Amazon. My bench, Amazon, about 50 bucks. TRX straps, they're fairly affordable. Power rack I got for free from my sister. The straps you see there are for pull-up assists. So there you have it. Setting up a home gym doesn't have to cost a fortune. If you're thinking about building one, start just getting a couple of versatile pieces like the Smith machine and add on as you go. I hope this video inspires you to create your own little fitness space, no matter your budget. As always, thank you for watching Mixing, up, Mixing It Up with Michelle. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more positive vibes, fitness tips, and healthy living ideas. Stay strong, stay positive, and I'll see you in the next one.